Hello there, I'm your host Dan Rojas and I'm next to a large Fresnel lens. We've been preheating some cement and some glass. We're using clear glass as the base. That way the cement block doesn't mix in. The clear glass acts as a barrier. You can't heat clear glass all by itself because the light just passes through. So you use the stored heat inside the cement to get the glass melted. Once you do that, you add other colors. We're doing green and blue to get a nice mixture. The clear glass also has another purpose that it separates the colors and allows more light through and that way you just don't have globs of colored glass on there. You need a drill and you need a piece of solid Pyrex or borosilicate glass tubing to wrap around this. Definitely want to wear some eye, you have to wear eye protection when you do this. These goggles good enough you think? Do we have enough protection? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. These are perfect. What happened? So if you do everything correctly, you should end up with something that looks like this. It's got a nice spiraling glass look to it. And then because it's clear bore silicate, you can run light up through there and it actually will act like fiber optic and light the whole thing up. The other neat thing that you can do is you can make glass springs. They're pretty fragile but this will actually slide off of there. You can see that you can see how fragile it is. It is a solid glass spring. And the borosilicate will release. It won't stick to it unless you get a glob on there. <laughs> I'm your host, Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos.